I couldn't find a single video in YouTube that clearly explains regenerative braking in Mahindra BE6. All were explaining how to just increase or decrease the regen level, but not a single person is explaining the whole concept. As an electric vehicle owner, you must fully understand the reason function because it saves money by increasing the range and also it increases the driving comfort. This video is divided in two parts, the simple explanation that everyone in YouTube is explaining and then the detailed explanation, the most important one that no one is explaining. The simple explanation doesn't tell you anything. The detailed one explains the following 12 important things. So let us start with the simple explanation. As you can see in the display, reason is off. To increase the reason, press the plus sign in the steering wheel. As you can see, reason level has been changed to L1. To further increase, press the plus sign switch to increase the reason level to L2 and L3. Now to reduce reason level, press the minus switch. There is another way to increase or decrease the reason level by pressing the plus and minus switch in the gear shift lever. To switch to auto reason, press the minus switch for a few seconds and release and then again press the minor switch. Auto reason will be activated. Again press the minus switch for few seconds and then press minus switch again. Auto reason will be deactivated. Now let's move to the detailed explanation. Detailed explanation 1. What is regenerative braking? Regenerative braking is an energy recovery mechanism in an electric vehicle that captures and converts the kinetic energy produced during braking into electrical energy which is stored in the vehicle's battery for future use. When decelerating or driving downhill, regenerative braking is utilized to charge the high voltage battery. When you decelerate, that is release the accelerator pedal, brake is auto-applied to reduce the speed of the vehicle. In Mahindra B6, driving in down gradient, when accelerator pedal is released, regenerative braking will provide some energy to recharge the battery pack and simultaneously assist in deceleration. Now let us see this practically in B6. As per B6 owner manual in, in driver display, the line to the extreme right is known as the reason gauze. The reason gauze is divided in two parts. The upper larger part is for acceleration while the lower part is for deceleration. Now when I press accelerator pedal, you can see there is a meter like light moving up in the accelerator section of the reason gauze. When I release the accelerator pedal, you can see the speed is reducing. You will feel braking is automatically applied and the meter like light is increasing in the deceleration section that is the lower part of the reason gauze. This indicates regenerative braking is in use by B6. Detail explanation 2. Why ICE vehicle can't have reason? Regenerative braking requires two components. One is the bigger electric motor that can convert the kinetic energy to electric energy and second a battery to store the energy produced for future use. An ICE car neither have the electric motor to convert the kinetic energy to electric energy and the battery pack to store the energy. Detail explanation 3. Whether hybrid cars have reason? The answer is yes. Hybrid cars like the Grand Vitara has regenerative braking because it has an electric motor and a battery pack, though a smaller one. Detail explanation number 4. Whether 59 kilowatt hour and 79 kilowatt hour have the same reason capacity? The answer is not known. Reason is not dependent on battery capacity, rather it depends on electric motor power. As we know, the Pack 3 Select has 59 kilowatt hour battery and is equipped with 170 kilowatt motor power. The Pack 3 has 79 kilowatt hour battery and is equipped with 210 kilowatt motor. Higher the motor power, higher is the braking force. But as regeneration is dependent on multiple factors, hence Pack 3 has better reason than Pack 3 Select is a question that only Mahindra can answer. Detail explanation number 5 Whether AWD has better reason than FWD or RWD? All wheel drive is powered with two electric motors, whereas forward wheel drive or the rear wheel drive has only one electric motor in the front. So, all wheel drive or the quad wheel drive as present in Tata Harrier EV may have better reason capabilities than Mahindra's FWD EVs, the BE6 or the XCB9E. 
सो अन ए डब्ल्यू डी और क्यू डब्ल्यू डी मोटर कैन स्लो द कार डाउन एक्सपोनशियली फास्टर दैन ए सिंगल रिजेनरेटिव मोटर लाइक द एफ डब्ल्यू डी और द आर डब्ल्यू डी इट इज ऑल्सो सेट दैट एफ डब्ल्यू डी हैज बेटर रीजन कैपेबिलिटीज दैन आर डब्ल्यू डी सो मेकेनिकली स्पीकिंग द रीजन लेवल इज लोएस्ट इन आर डब्ल्यू डी एंड हाइएस्ट इन ए डब्ल्यू डी हाउ एवर रीजन कैपेबिलिटीज ऑल्सो डिपेंड्स ऑन द सॉफ्टवेयर बींग यूज इन द कार ब्रेकिंग टेक्नोलॉजी और ओवरऑल टेक्नोलॉजी ऑफ द कार सो ए टेस्ला आर डब्ल्यू डी से द मॉडल वाई हुई वॉज लॉन्च इन इंडिया मे हैव बेटर रीजन कैपेबिलिटीज दैन द टाटा हैरियर ई वी ए डब्ल्यू डी और महिंद्रा बी ई सिक्स आर डब्ल्यू डी करेंटली देर आर नॉट एनी पैरामीटर्स विच डिसाइड हुई कार हैज बेटर रीजनरेटिव ब्रेकिंग डिटेल एक्सप्लेनेशन नंबर सिक्स हाउ टू सी हाउ मच एनर्जी आई हैव गेन्ड इन ए ट्रिप एंड इन टोटल एज ऑन डेड टू सी हाउ मच एनर्जी यू हैव गेन्ड ड्यूरिंग ड्यू टू रिजनरेटिव ब्रेकिंग इन ए ट्रिप गो टू मी फॉर यू एप क्लिक ऑन द थ्री लाइन्स इन द टॉप लेफ्ट कर्नर देन क्लिक ऑन इको सेंस देन क्लिक ऑन ट्रिप्स देन स्वाइप राइट द एनर्जी गेन सेक्शन विच इज करेंटली सोइंग एज जीरो किलो वाट आवर इज द एनर्जी गेन ड्यू टू रिजनरेटिव ब्रेकिंग एज एनर्जी गेन इज वेरी हाई ड्यूरिंग डाउन हिल ट्रेवल आई विल सो यू द एनर्जी गेन वेन आई ट्रेवल बैक फ्रॉम महाबलेश्वर टू मुंबई यू कैन सी देर इज अ नाइन किलो वाट आवर ऑफ एनर्जी गेन हुई इज ह्यूज to see how much energy you have gained overall click on app button in the display screen click on energy then click on battery and then click on the accumulated tab the recuperation section is the energy that has been saved due to regenerative braking 197 kilowatt hour that's huge right for a vehicle which has run only for 2300 km detail explanation number 7 when to use l1 l2 and l3 region level let us understand what are this l1 l2 l3 called as as per be6 owner manual these are called recuperation level so what is recuperation recuperation in an electric vehicle is the process of converting kinetic energy energy of motion into electrical energy during braking or when coasting rather than letting it go to waste as heat so when you decelerate that is release the accelerator pedal brake is auto apply to reduce the speed of the vehicle if reason is off after releasing the accelerator pedal the speed of the vehicle does not instantly reduce rather it takes some time as no automatic braking is applied like in the petrol or diesel cars you have to apply brakes manually to reduce the speed now depending on how fast you want to reduce the speed of the vehicle after releasing the accelerator pedal you can set the reason level accordingly l3 is the maximum reason level at reason level 3 the speed of the vehicle reduces faster in comparison to reason level l1 in fact when you drive in l1 or l2 or l3 you can flee, feel the brakes are auto applied as suddenly the speed reduces in comparison to when the reason level is set to off in bumper to bumper traffic or heavy traffic reason level l3 is more suitable while on highways l1 is more suitable reason level detail explanation number 8 whether one pedal drive uses reason the answer is yes one pedal drive uses l3 reason we can see the reason level is l3 let us reduce the reason level to l1 and press one pedal drive switch one pedal drive mode is on and again press the switch to make it off you can see l3 is being displayed detail explanation number 9 whether one pedal drive and l3 reason are same the answer is no while the regeneration level is same in one pedal drive if you release the accelerator pedal the vehicle automatically stops moving when the speed reaches to zero however if you drive your vehicle in reason level th- l3 uh, though the speed reduces similar to one pedal drive but the vehicle does not completely stop it keeps moving at a speed of let's say 5 to 7 km per hour you have to press the brake pedal manually to completely stop the vehicle so in bumper to bumper traffic one pedal drive is more suitable rather than driving the vehicle in reason level l3 as you don't have to use the brake pedal at all detail explanation number 10 how to maximize energy gain in reason always set the reason level to l1 don't set reason to off make sure reason level is set to l1 in downhill travel detail explanation number 11 what is auto reason and when to use it in auto reason the vehicle decides the reason level automatically 
इट इज लाइक वन पेडल ड्राइव मोड बट स्विटेबल फॉर हाईवेज इफ द रोड्स आई हेड आर क्लियर इट इट विल रीजन इक्वेलिन टू एल वन बट इफ देर इज अ ट्राफिक इन फ्रंट ऑफ यू इट विल रीजन इक्वेलिन टू एल थ्री ऑन हाईवेज इफ एनी व्हीकल इज डिटेक्टेड बाय द सेंसर एल थ्री रीजन इज ऑटो अप्लाइड टू स्लो डाउन द व्हीकल हाउ एवर इन ऑटो रीजन द व्हीकल नेवर कम्स टू कंप्लीट हल्ट लाइक द वन पेडल ड्राइव यू हैव टू प्रेस ब्रेक पेडल्स मैनुअली सो ऑटो रीजन इज एब्सोल्यूटली नॉट यूजफुल फॉर बम्पर टू बम्पर ट्राफिक इट इज सुइटेबल ओनली फॉर हाईवेज डिटेल एक्सप्लेनेशन नंबर ट्वेल्व फेदर ऑटो रीजन एंड अडेप्टिव क्रूज कंट्रोल आर रिलेटेड both auto reason and adaptive cruise control reduce the speed of the vehicle if a vehicle is detected in the front by the sensors both can be simultaneously used in mahindra b6 however adaptive cruise control uses mechanical brakes to adjust the speed and auto reason uses gener- regenerative braking when the vehicle is detected mahindra b6 manual does not specify anything on this I would rather not use auto reason while adaptive cruise control is engaged as brakes are auto applied in both the cases rather I'll keep the vehicle at L1 reason and switch on to adaptive cruise control in MG ZSV the vehicle does not use reason while using adaptive cruise control whether this is a design flaw or anything else that MG has not clarified However high end cars like the Kia EV6 has also similar setup to use reason while the vehicle is still engaged in adaptive cruise control so we have come to an end of this video i hope i have covered many things here if anything is left we can discuss it in comment section